Hey, Tiox, how are we doing here? We're looking at wave behaviors today with our Waves on a String app. And uh, we're going to, what, select Pulse. Uh, we're starting with Loose End over there on the right. We want no damping. And I think that's where we want to be, everybody. So if we make one pulse here, oh, that was too much, Welty. Hold on. Restart. All right, so we want to try to make one pulse, and I'm going to pause it. You see it's moving from towards the right, uh, towards this free end. We call this the incident pulse because it hasn't undergone a behavior yet. And we want to see what it looks like after it hits this free end. It comes back to where it came from. So if I go slow motion style here and I see it going down, do, 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 do. Uh, it's going to hit that free end and it's going to come back and we can see it comes back to the left and it's still a positive pulse. So it still looks the same um, moving from right to left. We call that free end or loose end reflection where the pulse comes back the same way um, as a positive pulse as it did before. All right, let's restart and we want to try fixed end here and see how this wave pulse reflects. So if we start off again, we have our incident pulse moving left to right towards the fixed end here. And we want to see what happens when it gets there. I'll go slow-mo style. You can also hit the slow motion button if you wanted to. And now when it hits the fixed end, it comes back. Oh, it's a negative pulse now. True story. So now it's moving to the left. It's reflected off the fixed end and it is now a negative pulse. It's below where it started from. Uh, so there's the difference between open end and fixed end reflection. All right, we're gonna restart again for the other part. Here we wanna make two pulses, and I think, yeah, we gotta go loose end on this one. So I wanna make two pulses. I wanna start off with one here going down and another one, and I wanna pause it. Oh, that's too much. See, it's hard to do, everybody. Uh, it's hard to time it. So I'm gonna restart again. So one and two, and I'm gonna pause it. Perfect. Uh, so this pulse is moving to the right. This pulse is moving to the left. And we want to know what happens when they meet here in the middle. So if I go slow-mo, who knows they're both positive pulses, by the way. If I go slow-mo style, do, 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 Oh, right. They meet here, and they make a much larger pulse of twice the amplitude as well. So they interfere, and we call this constructive interference because they made a much larger pulse. And if I keep slow mowing, we see this one here that was moving to the left is still going that way. This one here that was moving to the right is still going that way. Just showing that pulses, when they interfere, they keep moving through each other, they pass through each other because after all, waves are just energy, everybody. Um, all right, I'll let you try that on your own as well. Let's hit restart. Oh, we want fixed end now. And we want to make our two pulses again. At this time, I have my positive pulse going down to the right. Here's now a negative pulse that's moving to the left. We want to see what happens when they meet and interfere here in the middle. So if I go slow-mo style, choo, 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 you like the sound effects. Choo, 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 choo. Oh, right there or, or so. Here they meet and there's no wave there anymore. I really see kind of like almost zero amplitude. The wave totally destroys itself and we have this destructive interference. Uh, before with constructive, it was this huge pulse here. Here we have destructive interference and no amplitude. Uh, if we keep slow mowing, you can see that that pulse, that negative pulse on the bottom is still moving to the left. A positive pulse on the top is still moving to the right. Again, showing that waves, when they interfere, they simply pass through each other. All right, thanks for watching. Wave Behaviors, T-Hawks.